Now to Nairobi, Kenya, where on Wednesday, a massive fire destroyed the arrival hall of Kenya's international airport. Now, no serious injuries were reported. The fire, which broke out on the 15th anniversary of the bombing of the U.S. Embassy buildings in Nairobi and Dar es Salaam, uh, did cause a lot of destruction, but there were no immediate signs of terrorism in today's events. Dark black smoke was visible across much of Nairobi as emergency teams battled the blaze and passengers reported a slow response by the under-resourced fire brigade. The fire raged for more than two hours before being contained, and the country's largest newspaper, The Daily Nation, reported last month that Nairobi County does not have a single working fire engine and that three fire engines were auctioned off in 2009 because the country had not paid a $1,000 repair bill. Nairobi has one of the largest airports in East and Central Africa and serves at least five continents. According to the AP, Kenyan officials say the airport has now reopened for domestic and cargo flights.